How to collapse cells in Excel. When you have a large amount of data on your worksheet that runs into many rows and columns, you may want to group the columns or group the rows, uh, and this feature collapses them so that it's easier to view the data on the sheet and easier to manage it. This feature is useful also when you have subtotals in the sheet and you want to collapse the cells so that the subtotals are easily visible. In this example, I have a data set and I want to group the rows that appear above the subtotal. To do that, I select the cells. These are the cells I want to collapse. Under Data, I go to Outline, under which I have the option to group. So I select uh, the Group option and say Group. Now I get asked whether I want to group the rows or columns. I'm going to say Rows and say OK. Now you can see that this Group outline has appeared over here at the bottom of which there's a minus sign. Now to collapse these cells, I just need to click on this and you can see that it all gets grouped together. The cells are collapsed and I can see the subtotal. You can see here's row 1 and here's row 11. To expand it, I can just click on the plus. I also have the levels of grouping uh, given at the top, either 1 or 2, and I can click the appropriate level to group or to ungroup. This is how to collapse cells in Excel. Please read the appended article for more information.